An international investigation into child pornography leads to the arrest of a Burke County elementary teacher. Authorities say current and former students of third grade te drama teacher Michael Alexander are among his victims. Investigators have identified at least three local victims from pictures and video obtained from an accused pedophile arrested in Spain. We're just trying to get your side, Michael. What do you say to the kids? Officers escorted Michael Alexander to his first court appearance this morning. The 54-year-old faces numerous sex offenses after being connected to an international child pornography ring. Devastated. The whole school community, devastated. Shockwaves spread through Hildebrand Elementary where he taught drama. Very popular teacher, very popular with kids, parents, uh, other teachers, faculty, you know, very popular teacher. But detectives say it's also where he allegedly sought out his victims. There's potentially scores of children. He's been in the school system for 12 years. Alexander was snagged in an international cyber crimes probe called Filippo, coordinated by Europol. Europol investigators contacted the FBI after seeing a T-shirt in the pictures that identified Hildebrand Elementary. When we started to investigate, uh, we learned that there's children that was at Hildebrand Elementary that were identified in a video from Spain. State and federal agents interviewed parents and students at the school today, where the school offered counseling as they search for more possible victims. The law enforcement are meeting with people here at school. We're just providing support, guidance, whatever they need. Investigators say Alexander was photographing girls as young as eight years old, performing lewd and sexual acts on adults, and trading them in an international pornography ring. They started identifying the children uh, via the uh, videos that had been transferred from our North Carolina uh, guy that we arrested and the Spanish pedophile. Alexander is being held under a $1 million secured bond. Anyone with information should contact the Burke County Sheriff's Office.